Hey guys, this is Maria from Conceda's Nutrition Team, and today's customer question is, what are the main causes of gut infections like Candida and SIBO? While yeast and bacterial overgrowth may be responsible for your GI symptoms, there are deeper root causes that can lead to unhealthy proliferation of these microbes in the first place, your immunocompromise. Yeast overgrowth or SIBO is often more common in people with weakened immune system. This includes very young children, the elderly, and people taking immunosuppressant drugs like steroids. You've used proton pump inhibitors. Proton pump inhibitors are medications prescribed for acid reflux that lower stomach acid. However, a certain level of stomach acid is needed not only for digesting food, but for killing potentially harmful microbes before they reach the intestines. Long-term use of these medications has been implicated in both candida and SIBO. Besides PPI, other factors such as age, nutrient deficiencies, and high stress levels can contribute to the low stomach acid levels that make you more likely to experience gut infections. You've recently taken antibiotics. If you've taken on a lot of conventional antibiotics, you may experience GI symptoms that could be fungal and bacterial related. If you need to go on antibiotics, taking a probiotic like Consider Restore alongside can help prevent yeast overgrowth. Something slowing your gut motility. Anything that slows movement of food through your small bowel is also a significant risk factor for both yeast overgrowth and SIBO. This includes things like diabetes, certain medications, GERD, and lack of fiber in the diet. Sedentary behavior can also be a factor because it impairs blood flow to the digestive tract. Anytime food sits in the small intestines longer, bacteria and fungi can take up precedence where they shouldn't. Treatment for candida and SIBO often requires a holistic approach involving antimicrobial therapy and dietary and lifestyle changes. A qualified healthcare practitioner can aid in your diagnosis, come up with a tailored treatment plan, and provide the necessary long-term support that will keep these risk factors in check. We hope this answers your question. If you want to contact us for more information, please email us at support.concida.com and we'll get back to you. At Concida, your health is important to us.